What's going on guys, Killer6 back with another legendary item guide from Borderlands 3 and yet another DLC 3 weapon. There has been so many of these things. This time we're looking at the Mother 2. This one is a Turbo Rad Mother 2 and that just means it's going to be radiation damage. Uh, your prefix will vary depending on the parts that you're spawns with. The base damage on mine is 1,848. 69% accuracy, 58% handling, reload time of 1.6 seconds, fire rate 3.34, shots per second, and mag size of 22. The red text says, thank you for taking the time to read this flavor text. This flavor text loves you. I have no idea. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Maybe that's just in reference to like mothers and how, you know, sometimes we're not as attentive to our mothers as we need to be. And sometimes mothers love it when you actually uh, pay attention to something that they write to you. I don't know. Uh, otherwise, I don't think that red text has anything to do with anything in pop culture. Now, the Mother 2 is an interesting gun because what happens is when you shoot this thing and you throw reload it, it sends out these little drones. And these little drones will scurry across the ground until it comes across an enemy and then it kind of just latches onto them and does DOT. Uh, you can send out multiple of these at a time. There's five, there's six, and it looks like you can get about six out before they start exploding the first ones. Uh, now, if you can reload faster, maybe you can get out a few more on. The annoyment that I got on mine is after using phase slam, weapon damage is increased by 300% for a short time. And we're gonna phase slam and see if we can get any kind of damage out of these guns or out of these uh, drones. Because honestly, when I've been using this thing, I have not seen much in the way of damage from the drones or the gun itself it seems to be massively underperforming um i don't know i could be completely wrong on that obviously uh i do love that the the drones track people down and then like i said they stick to them and they do this dot on them uh, but even with that it's just it's not that much damage and i don't know man it, it just feels kind of weak especially compared to some of the other uh, dlc guns that we've had that have been really amazing uh, this one just doesn't feel all that good. Why did, did that dude just jump all the way up there? Holy crap, that's kind of impressive in a way. Uh, but yeah, the Mother 2, I just don't get it, man. Maybe there's something about this gun that I'm missing. The uh, the DOT, if you're rocking some sort of build that is heavy on uh, doing DOT, then sure, maybe you can get some crazy damage out of this. But me personally, I'm not getting much out of it at all. <laughs> I don't know, man. We should be getting 300% damage uh, right now after doing that phase slam. And uh, you see, it's just kind of underwhelming <laughs> at, at best. Because, I mean, I could switch to, like, you know, this and we just melt them down. But with the Mother 2, it just feels like I'm doing nothing to these guys. So, I don't know. Let me know in the comment section below. Have you guys used this thing? Has it worked better for you than it's working better for me? I've tried this thing on Moe's. I've tried it on Flak. I've tried it on Zane. Uh, I thought that I would get the best results out of Amara, but I don't know, man. So let me show you guys how to farm this gun real quick, just in case you want to go get it and try it for yourself. So what you want to do is head to Gehenna. You're going to head to the Blast Plains, and you're going to head over to this part of the map right here. Now, the uh, closest fast travel station is right here, the Blast Plains Pump and Charge. So we're going to travel there and then I'll show you the route from that point. All right, from this location, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go around this corner, take a hard left, and you're going to head to this area where there's like a uh, fort kind of thing here. But you're going to head up onto this cliff and I'm going to show you once we get over there. Now, the normal route to get up there would be to take the teleporter right here and that's going to teleport you up there. But I want to show you a faster way because when you save and quit, you want to spawn at this station. This is going to be the closest spot for you because this will take you from here up this cliff and into the zone. Whereas previously, you'd have to start from here, grab a vehicle, then drive over there. So once you start from this spot, though, all you have to do is head toward these cliffs right here. And we're going to bypass having to use that teleporter completely by doing just a smidge of parkour. First thing you do is you jump up on this ledge and then you jump over to this ledge and ta-da, you are up there. You no longer need to use the teleporter and uh, you go through this little cave back here and inside you're going to meet the boss that drops this thing and his name is Slithermaw. Now Slithermaw is pretty easy. If you got a fire elemental weapon, wail on him real quick and uh, no luck on the first run. So we'll try, try again. Run number three. Let's see if we have better luck here on run number three. We got a rerouter, an unforgiven, 
And there it is, the Turbo Mother 2 next to mags will have 100% bonus radiation damage, uh, no element on this one. So obviously this thing can spawn in any of the elements, but it can also spawn non-elemental as well. And it being a T-Dior, you gotta throw it to get the, uh, the bonus effect out of it. Like I said earlier though, I just don't feel like this thing is really worth using when there's so many better options, especially with what came out just in this DLC alone. And again, to farm it, hit the save point right here on the map climb the mountain over here and come in here to take them on it's a pretty quick and easy farm it only took me a few runs to get that one but uh, again i really don't think that it's worth it uh you can get a variety of other things from this boss as well so that's my guide on the mother 2 hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did let me know down in the comment section below hit that like button hit subscribe tap the bell icon to be notified anytime i post another video i appreciate you guys watching and i'll see you in the next one y'all take care